So Jay, finally a win, finally a home win. How are you feeling? <laughs> yeah, mixed emotions. Because um, obviously I wasn't, I wasn't that pleased with the performance. Um, not, not through work rate and desire. I thought, I thought the players gave me that. I just didn't think we had a bit of quality today until maybe the last 20 minutes. But um, yeah, delighted to get three points because I, I, I played it down with the players for the game and said all the pressure was on them and it's not. It's more of a must-win game for them. But, but if I'm honest, it was a, it, I think it was a must-win game. Um, and so I'm delighted. I didn't think we were going to get there, but I'm delighted we got there. And, uh, and that's what we've needed, a scrappy 1-0 win. We've been, been asking for it for weeks because we've played some good stuff at times and, and come away with not what we've deserved. And, um, but yeah, we've got, got three points and that's all that matters. It's like you say, uh, perhaps the performance weren't quite there like it has been, but Lady Luck finally on uh, our side. I think as well you've got, there's a lot of pressure on us today. I think there's a lot of um, the players. I can feel there was a little bit of tension before the game. It's the quietest the change has been for a little while. And I feel that... Even when the game started, I think the whole crowd was so quiet. It was just that, I don't know, are we, we going to do it? So um, you can hear the relief at the end of the game. So it, it wasn't it wasn't a great performance, but um, but listen, the three points were all that mattered. And, and the lady luck at the end, like you say, when the lad goes through, I thought he was offside. And we're just waiting for the net to rustle and he puts it wide. And, and we've, we probably deserved that a little bit of luck. Do you think both teams were quiet? Uh nervous and cautious first half yeah, and really played it safe. I thought it was a very cagey affair. Um, very cagey. I think obviously they didn't want to lose the game. I think they probably would have seen the point here as a good result. Um, so it, it was difficult because I, I, and even myself at the end you're thinking should we, should we throw coats on? Should we? You don't want to um, over gamble sort of thing but um, it was a cagey affair and I think that proved in the quality of football wasn't it? Wasn't the best of time. Like you say, first half cagey, but to, I thought, to be honest, second half it was more or less a tap defence, wasn't it, in the end? Yeah, I thought we, we looked fitter. I thought we, we stepped it up. I mean, you've got to remember as well, the players have had two weeks off, so I think there's a bit of rustiness. Um, we noticed it in training this week, a little bit rusty with them not training as much, but um, I thought second half, yeah, we looked better. We got Josh higher up the pitch and Ando higher up the pitch to try and get balls in the box. Um, Blair was causing a few more problems in behind. I thought when Jamal came on as well, he caused a few problems. Um, so, yeah, they, listen, I thought second half we, we improved and, and I didn't think the breakthrough was going to come. I've got to give a shout-out to Wards as well, because at nil-nil, he makes an unbelievable save that could, could change the game, really. So, um, I'm pleased for him as well, because he's, he's took a little bit of stick here and there and uh, he proved today what a good keeper is. How big do you think it is psychologically, really, to get the win and to keep a clean sheet as well? Big, big for us, because... It's hard. I come in every day to train with a, a, an happy face and, and try and keep the players going. Um, when inside, you, you can't say where you're feeling. <laughs> I don't want to start swearing, but you, um, it's hard sometimes. So it's, it, 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 today, uh, what would be nice is coming in training. I think there'll be a different buzz around the place. But I just said in there, we can't get too carried away. We've got Sutton, Macclesfield, Wrexham now. So we have to take some points from them because otherwise, two weeks from now, we could still be back where we were. But... What it's done is it's given everyone a lift in there, and you can see the, the, the bench players, the squad lads celebrating with the others, and that, and that it meant a lot to them. And lastly, just a little bit of squad news. Is there any more news on uh, uh, Beckwith and Lafayette? No, I had a, a brief chat with Paul Doswell this morning, and I'll have a meeting with um, with Bill and Terry on Monday, and we'll make a decision on what we're doing. Uh, they've both been good. Uh, obviously, we didn't get the games out of them we'd like due to the weather. And, cancellations but um, they've both been great to have and they've brought a lot, a lot of experience and calmness and, uh, and, and I think that's been important to us.